what is the essential difference between the world of nature and the world of man? Because there's an obvious difference like the difference of artistic styles. And in the same way, there seems to be a complete difference of style between the things that human beings do and the things that nature does, even though human beings are themselves part of nature. On the one hand, nature is wiggly. Everything wiggles. You know, wherever human beings have been around and done their thing, you find rectangles. We live in boxes. Our streets, especially across states like Kansas and Nebraska, are laid out in a grid pattern. Why, they even dropped a grid pattern on top of San Francisco with all those hills so that cars run away. Because it seems that the human being really has a very simple kind of mind. And all this wiggliness is too complicated. I don't think it really is complicated. Because after all, it's very simple to move, say, to raise something or to open and close your hand. It's perfectly easy. Because we don't have to think about it. Things become complicated only when we think about them. And that's because we're trying to translate them into a form of life which is very much simpler and cruder than the forms of life we're talking about.